quit staring at it and eat it. Oh, 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 ran up in there. Oh, oh, got her. You got it. Keep reeling, Augie. Keep reeling. Very nice fish, Augie. I don't even care what happened for us today, do you? I don't even care. It was already an amazing day, right? I'm here at this creek this morning. Well, barely this morning, really. It's 11.30 a.m., so it's almost the afternoon. But anyway, I'm here on February 15th. Hoping to actually find more fish on beds today. The last few weeks have been a little bit frustrating. I've already caught a few fish on beds. Anyway, the last few weeks have been kind of weird weather. Cold and warm, cold and warm, so the fish have been acting real weird. Haven't caught any more fish off of beds. Oh, my dad caught one while I wasn't with him, but that's the only other fish we've actually caught off of a bed in the last few weeks. And I'm gonna be completely focusing on bed fishing. I'm not really gonna be stopping for anything I might make a few casts as I'm just walking along looking but I'm not gonna cast any other baits other than just tossing this Texas rig around while I'm looking for beds this water is not super clear like it was last year we've also had a few recent rains that have probably dirtied it up I don't know though if it was a bright sunny day I'll be able to see pretty good. I can still see okay, I guess. The only problem is I can't really think of anywhere right now that is gonna be any clearer or any further along in the spawn, I don't think. There is a pond or two I could go to that we've seen some fish, but we just saw them yesterday and they're still not acting quite right to be caught so I'm not sure I want to go over there and be frustrated all over again I don't know though I do have another place in mind I could go to to at least catch some fish today don't know that I'll catch any on beds but I don't know might Jeez, looks like braid. Yeah, this is gonna break. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dang it. Well, it's probably about my sign to get out of here. Well, it's about 1.30 now in the afternoon. I'm here at the pond that I was talking about that I should be able to catch some fish at. Not sure about seeing spawning action, but this place usually yields at least some fish. Never been here around this time of year though, so I don't know. Might see some spawners, but probably not on a day like today. Not bright enough. See some people out there on the dock right now, so I'm actually gonna head over here to this corner where I've caught quite a few fish. Throwing a rattle trap like I do out here a lot, the old faithful out here at this pond. I'm also throwing a top water today, but it's not very windy. In fact, it's pretty calm, so I'm throwing a bait that I don't throw often enough probably, a little prop bait. It's usually pretty good when it's calm like this. Hopefully I'm 
going to show why I should throw it more here today. This time of year a prop bait's usually pretty good too because it'll sit right over the top of a bed if you happen to be running over a bed. Sometimes that'll irritate bass and they're coming up and actually striking the surface even though they're sitting on a bed. Oh, no, 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 no. Dang it, dang it, dang it. That was a nice bass, and I don't know why I missed him. Dang it. That was a very nice one. I felt it a little bit. I didn't set the hook really, though. I was getting ready to. Dang it. sitting right here. Looks like he might be on a bed actually. Huh. Interesting. He's just a little fella though. Real little. Anyway, I think I'm going to try to catch this little fish <laughs> on this bed real quick actually. If he'll bite real quick, that is. I'm put on this little drop shot. It's a short drop shot. Try and drop it right in front of his face. Get him to eat it quickly. There he is, back in the bed again. Ooh. Ooh. Wow. He just ate the tail of the bait and ran with it for a long time. but a fish on a bed nonetheless is always pretty fun <laughs> teeny tiny little guy on a drop shot see his mouth is so small that's why I was having a hard time getting him to eat it all the way but <laughs> that was fun Fish is here again, but I have a feeling when I start pitching on him, he's going to spook off. It actually went right in front of his face right there and he didn't move. So I'm going to try to do that again and actually bump him a little bit. See what happens. Hmm. Oh, it seemed like he was going to spook off and then he whipped around so maybe that irritated him in a good way good way for me at least yeah, I don't know still kind of just hangs out there afterwards he's not really getting mad and running in there after it yeah, I don't know this fish doesn't really react very well so I think I'm just gonna keep pitching it past him and try to bump him into biting kind of irritate him into biting if you will at all I think it's funny because a lot of people talk about bed fishing like it's cheap or like it's easy or not even really fishing or whatever but <laughs> that's what you're trying to do all the time is trigger a fish's instincts whether it be feeding protecting eggs protecting young just territorial whatever it's doing you're trying to trigger its instincts so it's not like bed fishing is any different in that aspect it's just that you get to see them but honestly it can be a lot more frustrating than just regular fishing a lot of times because you can see fish and you know you're around fish but you can't catch them so a lot of people I think try to act like it's easy 
actually because it's hard and they can't do it very well. So they use that as their excuse for not doing it. But anyway, that's just my opinion. An opinion that is not unfounded. I've been bed fishing for a long, long time been around a lot of people who've bed fished for a long time, been around a lot of people who said it's not fun, a lot of people who said it's easy, a lot of people said it's not easy. I've just been around fishing in general my whole life really. I've seen all the attitudes towards spawning fish. <laughs> it gets quite crazy. Now this time I'm just going to try to leave it and see if he'll come back and then I can pop it up in his face. There he came back real quick. Yep. Yep, he whipped around on it there, for sure. That was a whipping around on it like, ooh, what was that? I want to eat it. That was close to eating there. Ooh, ooh, yep, nipping at it, nipping at it, ooh. Ooh, wee. Yep, he was nipping just at the tail right there. I'm actually going to try to bump him a little bit again here, though. Get a little bit further back into his bed. I think it might have been a little bit too far forward again. He seemed to react to it on the top over there coming in. Oh! Oh! He ate part of it right there, but just not quite enough to get hooked. I shouldn't have set the hook on him. Although sometimes that does kind of tick them off a little bit if they feel a little bit of the hook. But uh, he just didn't eat enough to get hooked right there. He did swipe at it though, so that's a good sign. He's not shy now. Oh, oh, come on. Oh, I thought he was going to eat it right there. He twitched on it real hard for a second. Come on, man, get back up in there. Spitting out grass again. He didn't like that. Oop. Got him. Got him finally. <laughs> Didn't get to get any fight out of him because I set the hook too hard and jerked him on the bank, but <laughs> finally got that sucker off the bed. Finally, finally got him. Hooked him real funny, that's weird. It's hooked on the inside of the mouth right here. Huh. It's hooked on the inside of there. And then just through kind of the front of the lip, not even the outside of the mouth, the front of the lip right there. It's weird. Anyway, the old one from being caught a while back. Very, very nice, pretty fish. Not very big, but like I said, probably just about a keeper. About a 14, maybe 15 inch bass. Very, very pretty. Made me work for that bed fish. Thank you, buddy. That was very fun. Let's see if it'll even come back. Spooked off really far, but there's definitely a big bed. Oh yeah, I see it from right here. You see him? Yeah, I think there's two. See one for sure. I don't know, maybe just the one. He's hanging way off though from where I first saw him spook off. Oh, is he out there? Uh huh. Kind of like this? Uh huh. Yeah, but if you put this in the bed, sometimes they'll come here. Oh. <laughs> you 
I didn't even know it. I was just trying to swim it into the bed. I didn't see the fish. And I actually bumped right over the top of him. And yeah, he whipped around for a second and then he took off. He whipped around for a second and then took off a little bit, but I don't... Gosh, I can't see nothing. I didn't even see him when I was doing it. I was just trying to swim it to the bed. Oh, there he is on the left. He kind of... Oh, uh -huh. he yeah, he's kind of twitching on it. He's kind of looking. That's a good fish, dude. Uh -huh. The fight ought to be epic. <laughs> In the region. <laughs> the fight. I gotta get him on first. I know, I know. <laughs> the fight ought to be epic. He ate like the front of it. You I see know. that? Yeah, yeah. And then spit it out. Yeah. Yep. Now he's getting in there again. Oop. Oh, oh, oh. Gosh. What happened? The drag slipped a little bit. Dang it. Rolled him all the way to the surface to... No, not roll him all the way to the surface. He went around the, the reeds that way and fought. You're going to have to look back at the footage. Oh, he's still right there, though. Oh, yeah. eat it wow Go all over it for a second there you know what I'm gonna switch baits I'm not sure it matters but I'm just gonna switch to a just a straight tail worm there he is right there In the world happened yeah he freaking ran up there and ate it all of a sudden I set the hook and missed him again golly get him to show up with those big movements but then he didn't want to eat it and it's hard to keep it in front of him like that there he goes now he's like just a jiggling he's going down on it he's going down to it come on fish come on come on go down there and grab it oh yeah not liking it right there come on Come on. See, I get it too far towards me too quickly, though, when I move it that much. Come on, fish, right here. Oop. Pumped him right in the face. He didn't like that. He spun around. Come on, fish. Come on down there and get it. 
looking at it, looking at it, creeping up to it. Come on, come on. Oh, come on. Quit staring at it and eat it. Oh, 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 ran up in there. Oh, oh, got her. Got it. Yo. Got her. Freaking spade. Do what? Ah. Uh, Nah, no picture. All right. Thank you for playing, buddy. That was fun. Very frustrating at first, but fun now. Keep reeling, keep reeling, keep reeling, girl. Keep reeling. You gotta fight now, huh? Keep reeling. 